Kroger. Mustache hides to kill you. Okay. Finch, don't talk about his hair. Also trying to kill you. <laughs> Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to the Tales from the Borderlands. Going to continue episode 2. Um, I think if we press continue now, we should continue directly from where we left off because it was starting a new scene and I'm hoping that saves after each scene. So let's go in and see what happens. Yeah, this is right. So we're showing Fiona's story now, what happened uh, when Reese was left off. See where they drove off to. I don't really understand why they didn't stop. I'm guessing they couldn't stop because they had no back tyres. <laughs> They're just getting pulled from the front. So they headed into some cave. Um, oh, what's this place called? Is it Old Haven? Or is it somewhere else? I think Old Haven's the final destination where we're trying to get to. Oh, I can't believe and they made a detour. Do you think the guys will be okay? I'm sure they'll figure something out, probably, but um, the Badlands are practically a graveyard. I hate to say it, but they're not going to last the night. Yeah, that's what I kind of thought. Between the exposure and the skags and the psychos, I've seen they're screwed. They knew what they signed up for. Caravan like this. We couldn't help him if we wanted to. I hope he'll fix it. We're not exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you gonna get him to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. Oh, please. This is me doing this. Nothing I can't handle. Okay, don't get too cocky. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. So we're gonna charm Scooter, are we? Into repairing our vehicle for free. Or minimal cash. Because we have got some cash, because I haven't spent much in the chances where we've been able to. So, um. Oh god, they've got Catch a Ride over there. There's a radio. Is it worth. It's not really worth touching that, I don't think. Pin up calendar. I'm a man, so I'm gonna look at the pinup calendar because I can't help myself. Does every mechanic have to be gross? <laughs> That's the mechanic way. Hey, loot container. Can we steal his loot? Leaving me out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. I think it's got a hundred dollars, wasn't it? Hopefully, he's not watching us. Uh, carry the three to buy back twelve. Oh, what the hell, man? I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Oh. Oh, hey, man, welcome to Scooter's Catch a Ride. What can we do for you today? Uh. Sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully, handing this place over to the new proprietor today, and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small business owner to franchise owner is surprisingly difficult. Haven't seen this much paperwork since my aunt cousin tried to marry him up. Oh, this is a really nice looking place you have here, Scooter. Oh, thanks, man. It means a lot. Business has been a little slow so far, you know, being in a hidden cave town and everything. But it'll pick up. <laughs> Hope it picks up, though. I'm trying to be nice to the guy so he gives us a good deal. Holy crap. I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Boston Over Death Rally. Oh, I was there, man! Did you see me? I was I was waving! You were a badass! Oh, <laughs> yep, got me. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I could fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about 2,500 cold 2,500? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. You have nowhere near that much. We're like 600. I or nothing, but you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where did it all go? Oh, cause my cousin, right? He said that his sister's friend's neighbor's husband won one of them races one time and the cats kept them fed for weeks. Yeah, someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually. Yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? Let me pitch you something, and it might be crazy, 
But if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? You gotta say yes. It'll be great. Maybe like a billboard, a couple of commercials, product placement. You'd be huge. Scooter, sir, you have yourself a deal. Yeah? Oh, man, this is awesome. You will not regret this. No way, no how, man. But, uh, say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase? Catch a ride. You know it. Come on. Don't be shy. I'm your sponsor now. Gotta hear how you do the catchphrase. I wouldn't say it's sell out. It. Let's just do it. Catch a ride. Oh, it was awful. <laughs> That's terrible. I'm thinking that we put a big old ad on your van, you know, like maybe a picture of me with like, catch a ride up above it, you know, all <laughs> cool, right? I'm looking all badass, you need to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, Scooter, right? Is he in love? Everything going okay? <laughs> I was uh, I was just gonna, you know, go grab the paperwork. Let me take care of that. Okay, bye. All right, man. Here's my standard endorsement contract. Don't mind the sub clauses about uh, explosions and whatnot. I might have copied it from Torg. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're yeah, doing it for free. Maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. Alright, so this is like an opportunity to spend some cash. Okay, let's see what we've got. You go ahead and take your time. A lot of good choices, I know, I know. Real classy ones too. Sometimes I just stand here and, and stare at them, you know? I know how it is. I don't know what this means. Is this all like just cosmetic? I mean, you get opportunities in this game to spend cash, and uh, well, just loads. Some of them are way out my price range as well. You know, what? We're gonna it's gonna spend some cash. Let's go for this one. Why not? I don't have an idea of which one to pick, so screw it. Purchasing that one. That is some fine taste, man. Like a treat for yourself and for me. Getting to do it. Can't wait. Come on in, man. We'll get her all hooked up and get to work. Who are these shady looking guys? I don't think we've seen this before, have we? Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Just bandits, is it? Hey, fellas. What can I do you for? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Con artist. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. Um, uh, get ready to run. Okay, listen. If things go sour, get ready to run. I'll be right behind you. I'll take the high ground, you cover the back end. Only if it comes to it. Oh. Looks like he didn't sell us out, and they weren't happy with that answer. Out of teach him. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Thanks. Hi, man. It was no big deal. Proper man ain't gotta turn in two nice seeming ladies. You might be murderers or some crap, but you ain't tried to murder me yet. <laughs> but seriously, please don't try to murder me. Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two, though. You got a place to lay low while I'm getting your ride all fixed up? Um, No. No? I say we hit the safe house. It'll have everything we need. Money, gear, new IDs. I remember when Felix first showed us that place. <laughs> Filthy rat hole. Felix is gone, but that stuff should still all be there. And... Maybe we can get some answers. Yeah, I think we can figure something out. Thanks, Scoot. Anytime. And I really mean that. I'm gonna go get started, okay? Is the safe house nearby? I'm guessing it's in this town. Reward is a purple skag bar. What is that? Is that just candy? 
Hmm. I don't like this. So there's a bunch of um, like bouncy hunters, if you like. Here too long. Is this the safe house? So I must be in this town now. Well, she's got a gun. I don't. Looks like he had company while he was away. Hopefully they didn't find the stash. Come on, look around. We gotta be in and out. Yeah. I got the door. Right, so there's a stash hidden somewhere. I don't really... Oh, panel. Here we go. Let's get in and out then. Hopefully this is the um, hidden stash. Nice to see an old friend. Right, safe. Sweet! Great, a flashlight. Maybe if we go camping. It's a black light. It's the one Felix used to check our first counterfeit bills. Oh, it looked familiar. It's hard to believe that asshole would be sentimental enough to keep this in his safe. Not unless he meant for us to find it. Alright, black light, homemade grenade. Can we just pick them both up or do we need to pick? Let's just get the black light for now. So you can check fake notes with that. And stains. <laughs> so we got a black light. Let's take this. Hopefully it's not going to blow up in my pocket. We've got quite a few things in our inventory. We've got Reese's boot as well. When he was trying to hold on to when he fell, up, fell off us. So is it worth looking around for anything else? Felix sure was into science fiction. Yeah, that's not that useful. Um, it's a paint can. Why are we going to check this with the black light? Let's see. I don't know why we're doing this, but there's an option too, so we'll do it. Look at this. What the hell? It's ultraviolet paint. I guess he wanted to keep all this a secret. Well, he left this for us to find, so there's something he wanted us to see. So does that paint lead to something? I don't understand. I love lamp. Okay, warm. There we go. You left something for us to find. So we're getting closer. Just like him to make a children's game out of something like this. You never could see us as adults. Well, maybe that was the problem. So we're warm over there. Anything up high we can look at? Anything down low? Here we go, chair hot. So we're hot there. Let's just look at it first. Ah, I see it! Right there! Awesome! What is it? Push the chair. It's underneath the chair. It's a little um, trap door, it looks like. Uh, if you find another flashlight under there, I'm leaving. Guess that's what we're searching for, huh? Guess so. Alright, it's a loot box ammo crate. What's inside? Oh. Better double check the contents. And um, there's money. What's the other thing? Oh, hello, sexy. You're coming with me. Um, anything else? So we had 410. Now we've got 910. So there's there's 500 dollars in there. Homemade grenade, we'll take that as well. So we've got two of them now. Um, Echo Com. That's like a communication device, isn't it? What is it? It's an Echo Com. Why is there. If you're seeing this, I suppose I'm either dead or worse. My plan worked. I'm sorry. Fiona. Sasha, there's so much I want to tell you, but the less you know, 
the better. Oh, give me a break. Halfway through the con, I realized we were messing with Valerie's people. I knew that, and I never revealed it to you two. Well, if you're watching this, it won't be long before she's coming after you. Change your names. Change your appearance. Change your life. Valerie? Take Do you know you that name? And go. <laughs> forget about the life you had. And forget about me. But know that I love you both. With all my heart. <laughs> I was watching that. Were you? Because if you were seeing what I was, you would have done that yourself. And what exactly were you seeing? A liar! I'm not gonna listen to another second of his bullshit! I can't believe you let him live! To be fair, I did shoot him. I wish I had that chance. I wish you hadn't shot him! Really? I wanted to take him out myself. It was always about the money. The second a big score showed up, he betrayed us. We had it. We had it in our hands, Fiona. Ten million dollars. Enough to get off this planet, enough to, to buy a new life. Felix may be gone, but I'm still here for you. I know. First we find that vault. After that, the rest will take care of itself. Well... I hope you're right. So, who's the lady that he said to be careful of? You want a sandwich? It might be a while before we eat again. Sure. There's someone else's gift box. It's on, um, let's grab it. So F, that's for me, Fiona. What is it? It's some sort of an upgrade. Still only holds a single shot, but it looks like it adds an elemental effect to the bullet. Um. A parting gift. So I've got one more shot now on my gun. Or is it a shot? Of, is it three shots? Good thing this comes with another shot. I used my last one on Felix. Okay, so we've got we got one shot then. I'm guessing that's hers, Sasha, right? Is that her name? I'm gonna give it to her. He left you something, too. I think these two really gotta to stick together, and I gotta be respectful. I don't want it. Uh, are we sure? Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure. You're not even a little curious? No. I'll just hold on to it for you. In case you change your mind. I won't. So stubborn. You really gonna turn down a dead man's final gift to him? Kroger, mustache, hide to kill you. Okay. Finch, don't talk about his hair, also trying to kill you. <laughs> you should be ashamed of yourself. Hands up, both of them. What you making? Sandwich. Hmm. Um, I say nice hair. He said don't mention his hair. Nice hair. What's that supposed to mean? It means your hair is nice. I will shoot you in the face right now if you don't. Oh, Finch, calm down, man. Don't talk about his hair, all right? <laughs> it was a compliment. How can you take that? It's such a bad way. All right. He's good. All right. I don't want to use the bullet just yet. I've only just got it. Hmm. Heard me going off. 
You see me looking at you. Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? Psh, for nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you. And you're making a sandwich? Tire up. Let's get out of here. Ooh. Oh, God. He's fast. Please. You embarrass yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him. Do it. You're pointing that at a dude who has people shoot him. Incendiary, corrosive, shock. He's got armor on, so I think corrosive removes armor. Fire's good for humans, though. Fire. Fuck! You all right, man? Oh, yeah. Re real good. <laughs> Look, you don't have to be a tough guy about it. It's cool. <laughs> His hair. <laughs> I wonder if you can could have killed him if he used the right one. Oh, click him. Hey, man. Hey. Let's do this. Come on. Go. What was that? At Athena, badass assassin. Hates Atlas, a lot of people are trying to kill you. So is she trying to kill us as well? Yes, she is. Awesome! Alright guys, moving on to a new scene there, I think, because we've got a little bit of a loading screen. So I'm going to end the video here, and we'll pick up and continue in this escape from these bounty hunters in the next video. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!